India is considering translocating a few tigers to Cambodia, where tigers have become extinct. In November 2022, India signed a Memorandum of Understanding with Cambodia to assist the country with the reintroduction of the tiger. This is another step in the translocation of big cats. The first step was taken when India introduced a batch of eight cheetahs in Kuno National Park from Namibia in September 2022. The last tiger spotting in Cambodia was way back in 2007 on a camera trap. In 2016, the Cambodian government declared that tigers have gone functionally extinct. So, why is Cambodia trying to reintroduce tigers now? 13 countries make up the tiger range of the world. Bangladesh, Bhutan, China, Cambodia, India, Indonesia, Laos, Malaysia, Myanmar, Nepal, Russia, Thailand and Vietnam. In 2010, these countries met and adopted a goal to double their tiger population by 2022. But tigers were then declared extinct in Cambodia, while the governments of Laos and Vietnam are yet to provide evidence of remaining tigers. India, on the other hand, achieved its goal and has 70% of the global wild tiger population. The main reasons for the extinction of tigers in Cambodia were habitat destruction and poaching. Tigers need large territories to live and the rapid developmental projects of the country put these habitats under stress. Tigers were also killed for their valuable body parts. Every part of the tiger, from bones to teeth and whiskers, has been found in illegal wildlife markets. Today, IUCN has recognized two tiger subspecies commonly referred to as the continental tiger and the Sunda Island tiger. The Indo-Chinese tiger found in Cambodia is smaller than the Royal Bengal tiger, but they are the same subspecies of continental tigers. Translocating tigers won't be an easy task. Although India has translocated tigers within the country, it has never done so internationally. Multiple challenges lie ahead. The successful reintroduction of this apex predator will not just increase tourism income, but also restore ecological balance for Cambodia.